name is William Kangpamba and I'm from Malawi and the economy of Malawi most of them we depend on farming yeah we depend on tobacco I'm 20 years old now my village I've got uh, 60 families here and my family we are about 20 I was dropped out because I didn't, my parents have no money to pay me a school fees and uh, a school fees is uh, $80. We have enough wind in Malawi and I, uh, I was thinking uh, what can I do to use that wind so that we can have something. That's why I decided to read some books about the windmills. The first time I saw a windmill in the book, they just come up with the build the, come up with the pictures, but they didn't say anything what you can do to build that windmill so that you can generate electricity or you can pump water. You figured that out on your own? Yeah, I figured out on my own. If this windmill is in this book, if, uh, if I can try, maybe I can make mine so that I can have electricity in the home. The time I was set to build a windmill, I was uh, 14 years. Uh, it took me uh, um, about uh, two, two months to build a first windmill. They couldn't believe that I would make something to generate electricity. What uh, makes people to start realizing that uh, this thing is uh, useful when you uh, power a radio. Was it music that was on the radio? Uh, it was uh, a local Malawian reggae music. And most of the people, they didn't know what I'm doing. They thought that maybe I'm, I'm going mad and uh, maybe I'm crazy. And uh, I didn't see the NS much support on the first time, but after I've built a little in me, it's when some people start to realize that, oh, maybe this is the useful thing, maybe you should help him, yeah. to your home so that I can see and uh, the guys came with some journalist and write uh, uh, an article about the windmill. A tractor fan. <laughs> well, first off, when you see these enormous windmills, what are your first impressions? Uh, from a photograph in a textbook, William built a windmill. This is a story that uh, that is uh, should be shouted from the rooftops. My dream is to 
finish my education and uh, in the future to start my own company about the windmills. Most of the people, they want technology about the internet technology, but they cannot use the internet technology without electricity. That's what I'm planning to do is to come up with the reliable electricity. Yeah, that's what I'm planning to do.